What's going on, everybody? Um, I'm jumping on here real quick um, to have a small conversation, a little conversation with my 11-year-old, since he wants to join the YouTube world. So we're going to do a little uh, conversation slash question and answer uh, thing here and see where it goes. So what's going on, Mr. T? It's going good. So you know we're here to talk a little bit about the Constitution, but mainly the Second Amendment. Um, in your opinion, you know that, uh, you know, New Jersey, uh, you need to have a reason, right, in order to exercise your Second Amendment right. Um, do you think it's fair that you need to have a reason in New Jersey? No. No. Uh, I agree. Um, do you... Um, do you think adding more laws uh, will help? No, because criminals, they don't care about the law. They don't follow the rules. People that do follow the rules, they get, act, they get treated like they do something bad. Yeah, that's right on. Coming from an 11-year-old. Um, so, if a criminal doesn't follow the law anyway, and a law-abiding citizen is or does follow the law, that means in New Jersey that a good person is unarmed and the criminal is the only one that has access to carry, carry a firearm because they're not going to follow the law anyway, right? So if that criminal had a determination or a decision to make and was going to rob somebody and they had a choice to pick from someone that was from Pennsylvania who they carry permit, they have a lot of carry permit holders out there, or someone from New Jersey who does not have a carry permit and able to protect himself outside their home, who do you think the criminal will go after? The person that does not have a weapon to the phones. So they would probably hit someone from New Jersey because they are a... Easier target. Easier target, and it's probably a less chance that the person is going to fight back, correct? Yes. Yeah, that's uh, that's how that's how I feel. Now, um, do you know of any? Um, do you know have any other constitutional rights? I mean, I know we we try to read the Constitution, the book that we have. I mean, we haven't went through every amendment yet, but to your knowledge, do you know of any other constitutional right that you need to have a reason? No, and one example is going to church. You don't need a reason to go there. You don't need a reason to read an article. You don't need a reason to do anything along those lines. Yeah, so so you understand that you know freedom of religion, that's your First Amendment right, and you can have that religion. Right? You don't have to ask the government for permission. You don't need a reason to go to church. That's what you're saying, correct? Yes. So, and people who, who work for a newspaper, they can write an article and express their, their views in the press, as long as it's, or it's, it's supposed to be true, because some of the stuff in today's world, they're not really writing true stuff, but they can write that newspaper. They have the right to have freedom of press, and, and you have a right to freedom of speech, right? So we're making this video. Um, as, a, as a form of freedom of speech. We are, we are exercising that right. Did we, get a, did we get a permit to do this video? No. No. Did, did we ask the government for permission to do this video? No. Um, should we? No. Why? Because it's in our constitution of freedom of speech. There you go. So when, so when it comes to the Second Amendment, they, they treat it differently than the rest of the amendments, right? Yes. Especially here in New Jersey. Um, so, in your opinion, do you think that everyone should carry a gun? No. Cause, because some people out there are crazy criminals and they can do bad things to other people. Right. So, that is a very good answer. Um, but, if, but if you are a law-abiding citizen and you're not crazy, and um, you don't have any kind of like weird disability like being blind, 
right? Or you don't have arms, something like that that, that would keep you. Do you think those average law-abiding citizens, not that they may or must, but if they wanted to, do you think they have the right to uh, to carry a firearm? Yes. So you you think it's okay for if a background background check? If their background check is clean, do you think they should carry a firearm? Yes. Okay. If if I were to ask you uh, a question to end this here, carrying a firearm is not to be cool, right? It's it's not to be cool. It's not to be cool. Right. So carrying a firearm is is for what? For your safety and your self defense. Well, yeah. Now, do you do you think you have the the right to 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 defend yourself? I mean, that's that's clear, right? It's, yes. It's a God given right to to protect yourself, right? So, if if you have the right to defend yourself, New Jersey's Constitution states that. Um, you have the right to defend life. That's what it says. You have the right to defend your life. So, can your life be in danger outside your home? Yes. It can be, right? Can it be also in danger in your home? Yes. So, you would, you would, common sense would feel that you can be in danger anywhere, right? And if a bad guy has a weapon and you're allowed to defend your life, shouldn't you be able to carry a, a weapon or a firearm in case of a confrontation? Yes. It's just common sense, right? I agree with you. So the, the moral of the story is that if you're a law-abiding citizen, you have the right to carry a firearm, but not here in New Jersey. In New Jersey's laws, are what would you say that New Jersey's laws are? Horrible, and I'm very disappointed in them. Yeah, um, you, you said there you have it. In conclusion, my 11 year old gets it, understands some of our rights, you know, a lot to learn, but he's getting there, and um, he gets that New Jersey's effed up. He gets that the laws really don't make sense. He gets that they're really set up for law-abiding citizens to fail. And uh, he, he knows that, uh, he knows for one, that I served my country um, to protect those rights and freedoms that are guaranteed and protected uh, for us. And yet, states like New Jersey um, continue to ignore them. Um, things need to change. Hopefully they do. Until next time, peace.